For the first time, astronomers have confirmed the existence of such a mysterious traveler, a truly isolated black hole, drifting alone across the Milky Way. This discovery is a thrilling breakthrough that opens a new frontier in the search for the hidden architecture of our galaxy. In this video, we're getting to know how this black hole was found, why it matters so much, and what it could mean for the future of space exploration. Finding an invisible object in the vastness of space might sound impossible, but astronomers achieved it through an incredible phenomenon called gravitational microlensing. In 2011, researchers using ground-based telescopes first noticed something strange in the Sagittarius constellation. A distant star suddenly appeared brighter and shifted its position. This tiny, temporary event hinted that a massive but unseen object had crossed between us and the star, bending its light, just as Einstein's general relativity predicts. To investigate further, scientists turned to the Hubble Space Telescope. Over the next 11 years, Hubble tracked the event. Each year, astronomers collected precise measurements of the background star's location, comparing how it moved against its neighbors. The data revealed something extraordinary. The lensing object had a gravitational pull strong enough to match a body around seven times the mass of our sun, yet no visible star was attached to it. At first, scientists considered the possibility of a neutron star, the dense remnant of a supernova explosion. Neutron stars, though incredibly massive, are still visible through various types of radiation, like X-rays or radio waves. However, nothing was detected at the site of the lensing event. Moreover, detailed analysis of the light bending, how sharply and how much the star's path was distorted, matched the signature of something heavier than a neutron star, a black hole. The Gaia mission, operated by the European Space Agency, further cemented this finding. Gaia tracks the movement of over a billion stars, allowing astronomers to measure how the star's positions subtly shifted during the microlensing event. Combined with Hubble's data, Gaia's precise tracking confirmed that the lensing object was not only massive, but also speeding independently through space, consistent with theoretical models of an isolated black hole. In 2022 and 2023, researchers led by Dr. Kailash Sahu published conclusive evidence in the Astrophysical Journal. The object, now designated as the first confirmed isolated stellar mass black hole, lies about 5,000 light years away in the galactic bulge. It silently moves through space at about 45 kilometers per second. Its mass and absence of light emission left no doubt. This was a lone black hole, invisible except for its warping of the stars behind it. The microlensing technique that uncovered this wandering black hole proves the power of indirect observation. By carefully studying how the invisible mass influences light, scientists have found a way to uncover the galaxy's most hidden objects, even those that defy all other methods of detection. The confirmation of an isolated black hole is a major turning point in astronomy. Up until now, virtually all confirmed black holes were found through their interactions with companion stars. In binary systems, a black hole can pull material from its neighbor, heating it up and creating bright X-ray emissions, making it easier for astronomers to detect. However, most black holes should actually be silent, traveling alone without any light to betray them. This discovery validates a long-standing prediction that the Milky Way should be littered with tens of millions of stellar mass black holes, the collapsed cores of once massive stars now roaming unseen. But without a companion star or accretion disk, these black holes are nearly impossible to detect until now. The black hole doesn't drift passively with the average motion of stars in the galactic bulge. Instead, it cuts through space at an atypical speed and direction. This suggests it might have received a powerful natal kick, a jolt during its formation when its progenitor star exploded as a supernova. If true, it confirms a theory that not only are black holes born from the deaths of massive stars, but that these explosive deaths can fling them into wild paths through the galaxy. 
Furthermore, supernova explosions are still poorly understood, especially in how they collapse into black holes instead of neutron stars. Tracking the speed and movement of isolated black holes can shed light on how asymmetric these explosions are, how much energy they impart, and what conditions lead to different fates for massive stars. With microlensing now validated as a reliable tool, future missions are preparing to scale this method to unprecedented levels. More importantly, this isn't the only unusual black hole discovery. Several other quiet or invisible black holes have recently emerged, suggesting a far more diverse black hole population than previously known. One standout example is the black hole candidate Gaia BH1, located just 1,560 light years from Earth. In 2022, astronomers using Gaia data discovered that a sun-like star was wobbling in a way that suggested the gravitational influence of an unseen companion. Further observations confirmed the presence of a black hole, but just like our lone wanderer, it wasn't emitting any X-rays or visible signals. While not entirely isolated, it was eerily quiet, challenging the assumption that black holes must always make their presence known through dramatic cosmic fireworks. Another case, known as VFTS-243, is located in the Tarantula Nebula within the Large Magellanic Cloud. In 2022, this system was identified as a binary where one component was an invisible black hole orbiting a massive blue star. It stood out not only because of its clarity, but because the black hole appeared to have formed without a violent supernova explosion, what astronomers now call a direct collapse. If true, this suggests that black holes can be born far more silently than previously thought, and may be harder to detect unless they're interacting with other stars. These discoveries, alongside the recently confirmed free-floating black hole in Sagittarius, form a growing pattern. The universe contains a vast, varied population of black holes, many of which do not behave the way we once expected. Not all emit X-rays, not all reside in chaotic binaries, and some, it seems, wander completely alone. With this in mind, future missions will be designed to hunt these elusive objects more systematically. At the center of this push is the upcoming Nancy Grace Roman Space Telescope, launching in 2027. With its wide field instrument, Roman will scan enormous areas of the sky, detecting microlensing events in real time with high precision. Astronomers expect Roman to find not just isolated black holes, but also other exotic objects, such as rogue planets and primordial black holes. By watching how they bend light during brief alignments with background stars. Meanwhile, Earth-based observatories like the Vera C. Rubin Observatory, also nearing completion, will complement space telescopes by continuously scanning the sky for transient events. Rubin's legacy survey of space and time is expected to generate petabytes of data, creating an unprecedented archive of microlensing events, supernovae, and other gravitational phenomena. This synergy between space and ground-based observatories will allow astronomers to confirm and study black hole candidates with far more detail and speed than ever before. Even gravitational wave observatories will benefit. As our understanding of the black hole population improves, scientists can better predict the frequency and location of black hole mergers, refining the models used by LIGO, Virgo, and the upcoming LISA mission. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this deep dive into one of astronomy's most exciting new discoveries, make sure to like, share, and subscribe for more fascinating journeys into the cosmos. See you next time.